Real Housewives of Beverly Hills' Erica Jane refuses to hand over bank records to a trustee who questions if the reality star has hidden assets. Erica Jane from The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills refuses to hand over bank records to a trustee. The estranged wife of Tom Gerardi was questioned in connection to Tom's law firm's bankruptcy case. Erica's lavish lifestyle is no secret. The allure of the RHOBH cast features glamorous fashion and beauty. Wearing Obey star Erica is no different. A trustee is curious about just how much glam the reality star needs, and at what cost. Read on to find out more about Erica's refusal to hand over bank records. The bankruptcy case for Erica's estranged husband has brought attention to the reality star's lifestyle. Tom's assets are still being investigated by a bankruptcy trustee. The investigation is a part of Girardi Keese's involuntary Chapter 7 bankruptcy case. Tom came under fire for stealing from clients and committing fraud against business partners. Thus far, RNEOBH's Erica has maintained that she was an innocent victim in Tom's dealings. However, the reality star's refusal to cooperate has brought her under speculation for hiding assets. Erica's glam squad plays a key role in the former singer's image. The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills cast flaunts expensive lifestyles, including lavish trips, high-end fashion, and out-of-this-world glamour. Page 6 shares that an attorney working on Tom's case stated, The trustee has received zero cooperation from Erica, which is constant with someone hiding assets. He reported that Erica has used the glam to continue to aid and abet these sham transactions that have been occurring with respect to large transfers of assets. Even more evidence against Erica's glam, guys revealed, has admitted in numerous filed tax documents that Erica's related companies have received over $20 million, according to the tax documents spanning multiple years. Erica's beauty and merchandise businesses were promoted on her social media pages. The trustee alleged that RHOBH's Erica started a business following her divorce from Tom. This raised further suspicion about Erica hiding assets. The reality star recently filed a lawsuit against Tom for a breach of contract. The reality star was seen in edited clips on RHOBH, and fans found it hard to believe that she was completely innocent. For now, the former singer has maintained her innocence. The trustee investigating Tom's case alleges that Erica may have hidden assets. Her refusal to cooperate does not help her claims of innocence. On screen, Erica's polished appearance post-divorce was questioned by a co-star who also experienced divorce. Fans also found her declaration of trust in her co-stars as suspicious because of the reality star's cold demeanor towards the group in the past. The unfolding of this season of RHOBH has certainly contributed to Erica's tainted image in the case. Erica and Tom Girardi to be the subjects of new Hulu documentary. Please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Erica and Tom Girardi are the subjects of a new Hulu documentary about their legal woes, and some notable former housewives are involved. Stars of The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills' Erica Jane and Tom Girardi's legal woes have yet another shocking development, a documentary on Hulu. The streaming service made waves earlier this year for the New York Times framing Britney Spears, which covered the pop star's media coverage and controversial conservatorship. Since then, networks and streaming services started developing more and more documentaries on celebrities and the legal system. Clearly, these Bravo personalities make the perfect subjects. Following the legal battle has been a roller coaster for fans. It began with a divorce announcement and spiraled from there. News came out that the former couple was under investigation for embezzling money intended for family members of plane crash victims. Another shoe was dropped when Tom's Alzheimer's was revealed, and he is currently under a conservatorship because of the memory loss. Erica's exact level of involvement is still murky and confusing. The question of how much she knew will likely be heavily discussed in the forthcoming documentary. The news of the documentary was reported by Us Weekly. According to the official press release, the housewife and the hustler follows the trail of documents and money to find out who was involved, how much they knew, and who will pay for the alleged crimes 
just as the latest season of RHOBH gets underway. Plus, a never-before-aired deposition tape of Girardi shows when the man who said he once had tens of millions now admits it's all gone. Erica has claimed innocence, but instances such as Tom's trustees suing her for hiding money cast outs. The press release goes on to promise that it will contain voicemail, messages, court records, and exclusive network interviews with alleged victims, and that their accounts depict Girardi as a charming litigator who allegedly dipped into client trust accounts to finance his lifestyle and wife's pop star career. Some notable celebs and bravo liberties are involved, including comedian Heather McDonald and two former housewives. One is Real Housewives of New Jersey's Danielle Staub, who is no stranger to legal drama. Eric is former Real Housewives of Beverly Hills co-star Donna Wilkie will also appear. Plus, there will be commentary from certain notable voices from the Los Angeles legal world, including Chris Darden, Brian Kabatek, and Neil Wertlieb. The documentary will be available to stream on Hulu starting June 14. Meanwhile, Season 11 of The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills is currently airing Wednesday nights on Bravo. Erica previously promised to hold nothing back about the divorce this season. Fans will have to see if she keeps that promise. Erica Jane throws shade on Twitter amid documentary scandal. Please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Erica Jane from The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills is throwing shade on Twitter at fans amid the fallout from her ABC slash Hulu documentary. Erica Jane is not pleased with how she is being received in the public eye. The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star is throwing shade on Twitter at fans amid the fallout from her documentary, The Housewife and the Hustler. The Housewife and the Hustler documentary allowed former clients and victims to have a voice and fans did not like what they were hearing as the movie is very dark and showcases orphans and widows. After the documentary dropped, her law team also decided to let her go as their client for Tom Gerardi's bankruptcy case, but then had a change of heart. Jane has not yet been charged with any criminal activity. She was named in the class action lawsuit for helping to embezzle money meant for the victims of Lion Air 610. It is expensive to be Erica Jane as of late. First, she caught without her glam squad while pumping gas and didn't hear the end of it. Now she has taken to Twitter to call out everyone who thinks they know the inner working of her life and legal issues. In an angry tweet, she wrote, When did everyone on Twitter become a asterisk asterisk king expert on others' personal lives? Asking if fans actually believe what is being portrayed in the media. This is not the first time Jane has felt she can attack fans and haters. She is known for her stiff upper lip and, in the past, has been called out for being very rude to her fans. Gravel fans will remember that the law firm Adelson PC filed a class action lawsuit on behalf of the victims. In a statement that was released, the firm said, While Erica publicly filed for divorce, on information and belief that divorce is simply a sham attempt to fraudulently protect Tom's and Erica's money from those that seek to collect on debts owed by Tom and his law firm GK. The real housewife has denied having any knowledge of her husband's crimes and currently refuses to give back property she claims was given as a gift. She is currently on trial in the court of public opinion as each week, her words on the Bravo show are being scrutinized. Why Erica Jane's lawyers dropped and took her back, explained. Please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills' Erica Jane's lawyers dropped her last week, but took her case back a few days later, and fans are wondering why. The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills' housewife Erica Jane's lawyers dropped her last week, but took her case back just a few days after. Fans of the show are wondering why her legal team did this and if it had anything to do with the Hulu documentary. Erica has remained quiet for the most part, and viewers are starting to take her silence as guilt. Gravel fans are currently dissecting every little word the housewife says on the show. Erica is slowly starting to reveal her side of the story on the newest season, and not everyone is convinced she is innocent. The blonde and her soon-to-be ex-husband are in the midst of a lawsuit claiming they withheld funds from Tom Girardi's clients. 
Erica has since left their shared mansion and is not giving any personal items back as she claims they were all gifts from her husband. Erica just told the other women on the show that she filed for divorce and planned on staying with Girardi until he died. The Beverly Hills housewives are just as confused as fans are about the situation and would like to get to the bottom of it all. Just two days after dropping Erica, the legal team is back on her case. On Thursday, Erica's legal team filed papers to remain her counsel after they initially asked a judge to sign off on their exit. According to Page Six, it is still unclear at this time why Dinsmore and Scholl dropped her case and picked it back up so quickly. The move is confusing to anyone following her case, and many asked why Dinsmore and Scholl had filed the paperwork to drop Erica to begin with. The law firm filed it just a few hours after The Housewife and The Hustler documentary dropped. A lot of people thought it had something to do with what was in that documentary that showed she had knowledge of her husband's wrongdoings before the divorce. That theory doesn't really hold much substance after they chose to take her back. Many are still trying to figure out exactly how much Erica knew about the legal issues surrounding her husband. While she has claimed she had no previous knowledge of his wrongdoings, the prosecution is aiming to prove she did. The Hulu documentary made a valid point when they noted that Erica was listed as the secretary of one of Girardi's LLCs and that money had been transferred into her company, EJ Global. Only time will tell if the housewife is guilty.